In this movie, we will learn how to log into the WordPress dashboard. You can log in by simply clicking the login link under the site administration area. For Selco websites, we typically put the login area at the bottom of the widget area. Find site administration and click the login link. Some sites, such as my test site, use the login logout plugin. With this plugin, the title of the widget area can be customized to fit the site. My site says, just says site. So we scroll down towards the bottom and we find it and click the login link there. Now some Selco sites, such as the Selco website, do not have any login links on their page at all. For those, we need to go up to the address area, go to the end of the URL, and add a slash wp-admin and press enter. On the login page, you enter the username that's associated with this particular website and your password. Now if you'd like the browser to remember that you are logged in, click the Remember Me checkbox. Then you can press Enter or click the Login link or Login button. Now if you've forgotten your password, there is a lost your password link at the bottom of the login area. You go ahead and click that and you can enter your username or the email address that is associated with this website. Click the get new password. This will generate an email that will be sent to you. That email may take a little while to get there, 5-10 minutes. Um, give it a little time, then go to your email client. Look for an email from WordPress with a title of Password Reset. Go ahead and open that email. There you will see a link to the site that this password reset was generated for, the username. If this was a mistake, you can go ahead and ignore it and the email will time out. Otherwise, you can press the reset link at the bottom of the email. This will bring you to the enter your password. Now, they provide you with a strong password. If you choose to use that strong password, make sure that you copy it and put it in your password manager, whatever that may be. If you do not like the strong password, you can key in a password of your own. And then click the reset password button. You will get a confirmation that your password has been reset. And to log in, you simply click the login button. and log in. If everything went successfully, you should be seeing the WordPress dashboard. From the dashboard, you can do nearly all the behind the scenes maintenance required for your WordPress site. The dashboard will be covered more in a future video. Thank you. Have a good day.